There is a shortage of dollars in Lebanon. It's affected the value of the Lebanese lira and is believed to be behind the collapse of the currency in neighboring Syria. The Syrian pound reached a record low of 950 to the dollar this week, more than double the official rate. The depreciation in the currency, which is the largest since 2011, so eight years of war did not have the impact that the economic crisis in Lebanon had. It's due to the biggest, the biggest Syrian depositors having their money in Lebanon. With the capital control, they're not able to move their money to use it, which will affect the Syrian economy. Lebanon's banks have been the engine for Syria's sanctions-hit economy. But this country has been in political and economic turmoil in recent weeks, forcing banks to control access to cash and prevent transfers abroad. The crisis has also affected tens of thousands of Syrian workers who transfer their salaries back home. They are now being paid in the Lebanese pound, which has lost at least 30 percent of its value on the black market. The remittances were much needed hard currency. Sanctioned by the West since 2011 for its clampdown on peaceful protesters, Syria has not been able to trade on word markets. With Western sanctions imposed on Syria, the business community uh, in Syria and importers relied on neighboring Lebanon and its banking system to continue the activities, including in trade, but mostly also uh, in smuggling activities. The Syrian government says the pound's weakness is because of sanctions, which it also blamed for a severe fuel crisis earlier this year. Tighter U.S. sanctions on its ally Iran contributed to the shortage, but fuel is now believed to be smuggled from Lebanon. Well, we imported 1.1 million tons of fuel oil in the first seven months of 2018. But in the first seven months of 2018, 19, we imported uh, 4.7 million tons of fuel oil. <clears throat> and uh, that increased uh, the demand for dollars because we had to pay, the market had to pay an extra $1.7 billion. Lebanon is no longer Syria's dollar market for the time being, at least. Zana Khadr al-Jazeera on the Lebanon-Syria border.